in this video we'll be discussing about some interesting question which has been asked by the multiple freshers so the question is can i start my career because i have a gap in my career so you know uh, what will happen basically like uh, there are many uh, people out there in the around the world like uh, they have started their it career and then Uh, due to some of the personal responsibilities or maybe some personal issues they were not able to continue their it career and they had to drop their career and after few years later they are thinking like okay let's continue with this career because they want to grow up uh, with the it industry so especially with the female candidate due to the personal responsibility kids and everything we completely understand that they cannot continue their uh, as a career so what to do in that case whether it is possible to start the career or resume the career so my personal suggestions will be yes you can definitely start your career even though you have a gap in your it career there are thousands of companies are there around the world they are looking for only the skill candidate they are not at all looking for what you were doing previously so if you have some good skill set and the technology in your mind definitely you can crack the interview and you can start your career as a not only to the oracle dba or any specific technology you can grab any technology also let me tell you like let's say you have some 2 years of gap which is a very small gap okay and due to some of the reason you were not able to continue your it career and you have a gap of 2 years now you want to resume your career or there are some people like you know they have completed their education after that they struggle lot almost 2 3 years they struggle and after that still they are not able to get a job or maybe they want to continue their job now they want to start their career as it here after the 2 3 years so for those people you know you have a options to look for the admin level jobs or you can also look for the programming level jobs when i say a programming basically you need to write down the coding so if you think that like okay let's say you are coming from the it background and you have some good exposure with the programming definitely you can look for the programming skill set like python is there big data technologies are there you can look for those kind of jobs and those people who are not coming from the it background and they think like okay programming is something which is tricky for them those kind of people they can look for the administrative level jobs like linux admin is there oracle dbas are there sap admin is there aws admin you can look for those kind of jobs where you don't need to write down a single line of code also because this these are repetitive kind of work where you no need to use more mind or you can say mind is definitely needed uh, but the creativity is always there with the programming with the development but not with the administration level kind of job so if you think that your gap is like 5 years or 7 years again it's a very huge gap right so obviously it's difficult to come back to the programming level of skill set i'm not saying that it's not possible it's possible it's all about your efforts what type of efforts you are putting so if your efforts are good definitely you can come back to the programming field also we can also call it as a development but if you think that okay now it's a time where you know i cannot do much efforts and uh, you need quickly something enter into the it industry try for the administrator level of job so we have a you know we have a set of jobs are there like we have a administrator job we have a programming kind of job we called it as a development job and below that we have a job which is we called it as support level of job let's say you are working with the it industry where you are just looking for installation of the software it's it it is a job you know coming from the it industry but where we don't need much creativity so those kind of jobs also you can try we have multiple jobs multiple vacancies are there it's all about you how you are putting the efforts so bottom line if i want to tell you like there is no restriction that you cannot resume your job after the gap you can definitely resume your job and you can start your career with the it industry and i'm always telling you people that 
when you want to start your career with the it industry there is no restriction like you should be a btech or be person any degree that is fine i see i i have i have seen a lot of people you know i have seen a lot of uh, experience level people they are asking me only a good oracle dba those who have some sort of knowledge technical knowledge they are not at all looking like what you like what is your like what degree you have because they have a client and they want to do their work and in order to complete that work we need skillful people so when you have a gap try to fill that gap by putting by giving some sort of technical skill set in that put some hard work work hard and definitely you can start your career as a well. whatever you want the technology so this is all what i want to share with you i am starting my oracle database training from in next two days if you are interested let me know and please do like subscribe and share this channel you can also enroll to the online dba course on my website the website is learnomate.org all the details are there in the description section there we have a interview question series which is really really good to crack your oracle database interviews thank you so much guys